it is here. I'm getting my stem cells. They're going in <laughs> right now. <laughs> My name is Dravea Japon and I am here at the Tom Baker Cancer Center for a bone marrow transplant. I have sickle cell anemia. I was diagnosed at two and it's been something I've been struggling with my entire life. I've experienced lots of um, emergency room stays. I know when I was growing up I felt it a lot in my stomach and my back and my chest. But then as I got older it, was, it became more of a joint and a bone pain very sore, very tender, and that pain is just very intense. Like I would say that pain is 10 out of 10. I remember you being one or two years old and just crying and crying and thinking. I was thinking, why is my little sister always crying? <laughs> I always knew when you were sick because you would always go run somewhere and hide. When we couldn't find you in the house or something like that. <laughs> I was, like, was sick. Where's Reve? Where's Reve? And we'd always find you <laughs> in the room either balled up or, you know, shaking and in pain. Eventually, Reve came to see me and said she wanted to explore the business of bone marrow transplant or stem cell transplant. The Alberta Children's Hospital has extensive experience in transplanting children with sickle cell anemia. And so we thought that we would build on that experience by expanding the program into the adult world. It's not for everyone. Uh, you require a sibling, a brother or sister who's got a, an HLA match or a tissue match. Uh, to serve as a donor. If you don't have that, we uh, can't do the transplant. I got the results for um, the testing on my birthday, and so it was the most wonderful gift that uh, anybody could ask for. To me, getting these stem cells is pretty much getting a gift of life, a gift that nobody else could give and she's just so willing to give this to me which yeah, makes me really happy. I'm very fortunate to have her. And now are you completely back to normal? Not 100% back to normal. I have not back at work or anything like that yeah. but pain wise I haven't felt any pain. So this is the first adult sickle cell anemia transplant we've done in Alberta. Um, and to the best of my knowledge, it's also the first adult sickle cell transplant that's been done in Canada. Um, so this is quite a, quite a step forward. We hope that the way her blood looks right now, um, with her decreasing levels of sickle cell hemoglobin, uh, that this ultimately means that Reve will be cured from her sickle cell anemia. Seeing her. Mm -hmm. There's no pain. Yes. Because yeah. when she have a pain, it's so sad. It's hard for a mother to go through that, isn't it? And thank you. Yeah. And thank God. I'm just so excited for the fact that at 26, your life is about to begin, actually. Yes. You'll be able to do all the things you were always unable to do. Mom, honestly, Steph, all of my hardest moments, sickle cell, non-sickle cell, you were there, you were the person, you've always been the person, you always will be my person, <laughs> seriously. My sister, my best friend, my donor, my everything. I'm so happy, so lucky to have you. Love you so much. Love you too.